Hi, this is Pamela, and I'm excited. I got three orders in from HM Aura Crystals, and it looks like they were three mystery boxes. Let's dig in to what I've got. I'm excited to see it because I do not remember. This is so weird. Okay, so this is a malachite. Oh my goodness, isn't that pretty? It's a raw form, and it's so funny. Uh, TikTok got really weird. You can show a malachite um tower or spear but you cannot show you cannot they don't allow you to show the actual raw form on tiktok it's so weird but isn't that gorgeous wow so pretty and what's really weird is because i had just bought a um malachite slab from them you know a raw specimen that was on a holder and they were able to show that on tiktok but then they changed some of their regulations yeah, the U.S. has been after TikTok. They want to buy, ban them totally anyway, so I think it's just a matter of time before TikTok is gone out of the U.S. There are other countries don't know, that do not allow the TikTok channel in their countries, so I think it's just a matter of time before TikTok will be bye-bye. And another one. So these were on the shelves um, with one of the boxes that had a number that led to their shelf. Yeah, these were not pieces I bought individually. I lucked out on this. I think I had my eye on these, and so my box was, I was, lucked, I was happy when it went to, to uh, the Malachite. Ooh, nice. Ooh, an Elapsi. Lapsaluzi. I can never pronounce that right, but yes, these are pretty. I love the Lapsies. Nice blue color. I'm not sure if it has that much pyrite in it, this one. Some of them have a lot of pyrite in it. And I got something mummy wrapped here. Oh, it's a snail. So these were on the shelf, uh, probably as one. I think this might be fire cord. But yeah, this is my first snail. I don't have any snails for carvings. Oh, that's right. They wanted to give me an extra gift, and so they had this black obsidian spider, and nobody was interested in it. So I said, I'll take it. I'll take that little black obsidian spider. Everyone gets freaked out by spiders and skulls and stuff, and it's like, why? Okay, so yeah, isn't that cute? Ooh, garden quartz. I am just such a sucker for garden quartz, especially high quality ones. Oh my God, I love this. I love this garden quartz. And I think this is one I asked for specifically. Nope, nope, this was on the sh shelf. I'm pretty sure of it. It's only $24 only. $24 seems like a lot for a small crystal, but Garden Quartz is um, limited in where they, they only mine it in one area. Very high demand and higher quality, of course, is going to cost more money. Yeah, I love my fire, quart my fire quartz. I keep saying that. Oh, my God. My Garden Quartz. I love Garden Quartz. I've ordered several of them since this, too. Yeah. It's even got some rainbows in it. Nice, high quality. And you can tell it's high quality because you can see through it. I mean, you can see the you can see the garden in it very well. Eventually, you won't be able to get garden quartz without paying a fortune for them. Yeah, there's a channel that I follow on TikTok. His Andy Crystals, I think, and he goes out into the um, China market out in the open, and then also to some of the indoor shops. And a lot of his customers look for these um, garden quartz. And I've seen I, I mean, I've seen some so pure. They're just they're just um, breathtaking, but I think this piece here out on the China Marketplace would probably go for fifty or eighty dollars easily. Yep, that's what they would charge for it. And this was on one of the shelves that my box led me to. It is Jasper Ocean Jasper. Oh, look at that! It has Druzy up there at the top. It's all shiny and crystalline. Mm hmm. It's nice and smooth. Where it doesn't have the um pockets in it yeah that's a nice chunky little tower oh that's pretty 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 they have the best ocean jasper if you like flames they have some amazing ocean jasper flames they're just huge huge so that was on one of my shelves maybe these were together i don't know i don't remember how they came out all right now i know what happened yep so this lapsa tower and the laps of sphere together were, were together on one shelf. So one of my boxes led me to this. I think I had another laps of, yeah. This is my second set that I've won off the shelves like this. It's a nice tower. 
that has some nice pyrite in it too. It looks like there's um, druzy up here, but it isn't. It's all smooth. There are no pockets in it at all. It's all smooth. Pretty. I love the color of these. I love blue anyway. Blue, blue. My world is blue. Nice. I like pyrite. Because <laughs> it glitters. Mm -hmm. So that was one of my shelves. Oh, and another amazing garden quartz. Yes, look at that. This one was $54. Whoops, I got it right. $55. So I might have bought this. Oh, I don't remember now. I do not remember. It's got some rainbows in it. Let me get it under the camera where you can see it. All right. God, look at that. Isn't that just gorgeous? Yeah, so $55 for this one. That in the China market would probably go for at least $20 or $30 more. Got rainbows in it. Look at that one up there. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's just gorgeous. Yeah, I do think I paid for this one separately. This is the one. Yeah, it is. This is the one that has, like, they, Anna was referring to them as goldfish in there. All that, those inclusions look like little goldfish. And I just fell in love with it. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure I paid for this separate. Wow. They do have some new garden course spears that came in. Spears or freeform? Because these are freeforms. I can't remember now. I think they're spears. Yeah, they're spears. Of course, by the time I get this uploaded, they may already be sold out. But look at that. Look at how gorgeous. If you love garden courts, you need to follow their channel because you're not going to find anything better without paying a fortune for it. Look at that. I have one coming, I believe they call it a thousand layers because it's got layers and layers of the the, court, the garden courts in it, um, the garden in it. So quartz likes growing around other minerals. So that's what causes the, the garden. Well, that's so pretty. It's going to go on my garden shelf. Mm -hmm. I got two of them now, and I knew what they were coming in. And this was on one of the shelves. It is a moonstone. Let me see if I can get... There it is. There's the sun flash. So it must be a sun moonstone. Yep, I thought I saw... Usually, yep, there they go. They're following each other around. So there's a moon and sunstone, or a moon flash and a sun flash. There's the moon, but I did see this. There, there is a sun, too. It's not very... Oh, I think you just got to turn it just right. Yep, there we go. So there's sun and the moon. So there should be one on the other side. Usually they're back-to-back. -back. Yep, there's the sun. So yeah, that's a nice, nice size moon sunstone. Not one of my favorite crystals. I still wonder why when people are mining and they run across these and they something twinkling must catch their attention and then they polish it and go, oh, this is pretty cool. Okay, so yeah, this was what, um, yeah, so guess what it is? It's another garden quartz. <laughs> this was my garden quartz day. Uh-huh. This one I did pay specifically for it. I don't remember. There's no price tag on it. Normally if it's on the sh if it's on the table and you pay for it, they'll have a price on it. I still think so I know my lapses came as together on one of my shelves, one of my boxes. So my moons the moonstone and ocean jasper might have been together. And then the malachite might have been together with this, which makes sense because this is only 24 and these um, malachite is a little expensive too. So that's probably how these were came together on one shelf. And then I bought these separate. Well, I bought them together, t separate off the table. So 55 for that, and I'm not sure what this one was. 
But oh yeah, me and my garden cords. But I just fell in love with them. And I have other stuff that I bought before this I haven't even got yet, haven't even received. I don't know. The shipping is just so weird sometimes on these. And then the bigger packages come by UPS instead of by the Postal Service. And look at that world in there. So what I love about Garden Quartz is it's just a world inside of... It's a world inside of a bubble. Oh, and this is what I liked about it, too. It had... Um, this one has some different inclusions up here at the top that caught my attention. Now, this is not smooth up here. It's not fractured or anything. It's just as part of the occlusion comes out of it. Oh, look at how pretty that is. That's a nice chunk, too. Ooh, so I can go on and on and on here. Anna gets this way with her Labradorites. I'd get this way with my garden course. This one, I didn't really see any rainbows in it. I'm sure there are. But it's got more inclusions. It's not cloudy either, per se. I have a couple of them that are somewhat cloudier, murkier. They're not as clear. But that's fine by me. I don't care. It's still a garden quartz. You can still see. Oh, I just saw one. I just had to move it just right there. It is right there. Right down there at the bottom. Nope, or is that the, my light overhead? Could be my overhead light doing that too. Uh, I think it's my overhead light. Anyway. So yeah, so I got my haul in. Got some lapses, my um, Ocean Jasper, Moonstone, some mala, mal, some Malachite, um, and my garden quartz, my beautiful garden quartz. So let me know what you think in the comments, and thanks for watching. Pamela out.